Let's start with question number 13. So it says a wall 24 meter long, 0.4 meter thick and 6 meter high. So we have dimensions of a wall. And it is constructed with the bricks each of dimension. Who is constructed with the bricks? And who is the dimension of the bricks? Who is cuboidal? Now it says if the mortar occupies 1 by 10th of the volume of the wall. मतलब एक मोटार है जिसने वहां पे 1 by 10th space ले लिया है एक वॉल के अंदर volume of wall में 1 by 10th space occupy की हुई है तो अब उस wall में कितनी space रह गई जहां पे bricks लग सकती है 9 by 10 so first of all we will find volume of bricks in the wall कि कितनी volume है bricks के लिए एक wall में so it will be 9 over 10 9 over 10 into part of the wall volume of wall kitni hai volume of wall aapke saamne hai it is 24 0.4 and 6 length diyo ya breadth diyo ya height diyo ya 24 into 0.4 into 6 points point hata sakte ho aap point hata hai niche 10 a gaya aap isko reduce karo ge aapke pas value a jaye ghi 57.6 9 over 10 into 57.6 so your answer is 51.84 meter cube this is the volume of bricks in the wall मतलब कितनी volume bricks ने ली हुई है एक wall में mortar को हटा के तो अब यहां पे हमसे बुझे कि कितनी number of bricks use होंगी इस construction में तो number of bricks into volume of one brick is equal to volume of brick in the wall अभी हमने निकाल है volume of total brick कितनी है हमारी एक wall में right तो अब आपके पास सारी values हैं आप इसमें put कर सकते हो number of bricks को हम n ले लेंगे volume of one brick कितना हो जाएगा 25 over 100 क्योंकि ये वाली जो सारी values हैं वो centimeter में हैं so we have to convert it into meter क्योंकि ये देखो volume of brick किस में है meter cube mein. so therefore we have to convert the left hand side as well into meter so volume of brick in the wall kitna 51.84 isko aap place kar sakte now you have to change the values matlab aapne cross multiplication use karna and it will give you 51.84 or left hand side se aapka jayega 0.004 so final will be 12960 so itni number of wo bricks aapko chahiye is wall ko construct karne mein is given condition mein so this is the answer now let's move on to question number 14